on my friends, it's been a really long time since I've made a video, uh, I just had a lot of shit going on, as always, my bad luck, uh, I bought the street scene mirrors for my truck, and, um, I noticed that the passenger side mirror was wiggling, so, um, lower the radio down a little bit, shut the truck right off, uh, the passenger side mirror was wiggling, so when I installed them, I put Loctite on the, um, bolts, to try to keep it from vibrating out, and, uh, that ended up melting the plastic, which isn't supposed to happen, and, um, I had to buy a backing plate kit, the mirror itself was good, just the adapter plate that bolts it onto the truck, um, that's what was all cracked from the Loctite, so that was 48 bucks, or whatever it was, I ordered those, put them on, truck was good, week later, in front of my work, where I am right now, a lady comes by and takes the mirror off my truck, so, with that being said, I just put the, uh, stock mirrors back on, and, uh, I'm not gonna fuck with it anymore, you know, because I try to make my truck look nice, and I have no control over, um, other people, which would be, like, keying cars, which I haven't had done to me, but I do have scratches along the truck from when I used to go off-roading, um, just, you know, it's just bullshit, I, bu I built the stereo inside of my truck, thinking that it would be safe, and they broke into my truck and stole that, and then I put uh, money into the outside of my truck, and then that just gets fucked up, I have no control over anything, so uh, right now I have one good street scene mirror, the passenger side is built, rebuilt, and it's perfect, and I have the adapter plate for the right side, so if anybody has a full-size Chevy truck, whether it be Tahoe, Yukon, Denali, whatever, Escalade, any style, 95 through 99, or even earlier than that, um, the street scene mirrors will fit on your truck. All you need to do is just buy um, the mirror for the driver's side, because I'm not putting any more money into the uh, looks of my truck right now. I'm just trying to figure out what I actually want to do. Um, I'm getting sick of spending all this money on this truck, and it's still nothing, nothing that great, you know? It's just average. Um, nothing nothing crazy so it's just it just seems to me like I'm just spending thousands and thousands of dollars and I'm just not happy with the truck um I'm just sick of spending all the money and then when friends call on the weekend I don't even want to go out because I don't want to spend the money to go out because I want to put it into my truck I guess uh, I'm just kind of getting over that and before I make any like drastic decisions on uh what I want to get rid of and shit and what I want to do with the truck. Um, I just know right now that the mirrors, if somebody wants them, send me a private message and uh, give me an offer on them. That way I can get some of my money back. But uh, other than that, that's just what's been going on right now. Um, I've just been aggravated. Nothing else has been done to the truck. Um, the alternator actually uh, was giving me problems, so I sent it out and uh, had it looked at, and the regulator went bad on it. So that was a cheap, uh, cheap part that broke, but they took care of everything for me for free. So Georgia Power Systems is uh, still taking good care of me after all this time, and I'm really happy with their customer service. Mr. Marvin is the the man over there, and uh, I recommend it to anybody. So I'll have my alternator back hopefully soon and hopefully I can get some base videos going and uh, that's about it I got one more video coming up after this one uh, that's gonna be about something about getting some free music so uh, 